Addison Ray drama. Oh man, I tell you, Addison Ray drama has been completely crazy. Like 100 percent guys. Um so now you might be wondering. These niggas beefing for IG, but bitch, I wanna kill. Kept getting blessed, cause bitch, I hustle. I ain't wanna steal. I whip this bitch out now in front of all these cameras, niggas. Know that it is. I hit out his slide with a warrant, I think he wanna steal. Them pussies pulled me over the little four way. The DA asked me for a picture, I wore Dior to my last court date. Nigga asked, I got a pass, I tell him no way. Bitch, we like A's, I'm on your ass. Four. And what? I don't know, did my mic go? Oh, it's peaking a little bit. What is this video for, right? Now, there's a lot of stuff been going on with Addison Ray, especially with L Little Gravy. They came up with that new song. Um, I'm not going to play it because of copyright reasons, of course. But, again, um, now, what you might be wondering here is that what's going on with the Addison Ray party and what is going on? And Monty is not referring to any of his kids under his wife's Shuri's kids so all of addison ray's brother and her he's trying to act like he doesn't have any connection to him anymore he keeps ignoring them he keeps not bringing them up he's only talking about his kids before he married into the family so that's kind of messed up because those are his kids and he's not being a good dad if he's about an alpha male he's not being an alpha male he's being a beta because the problem is is that if you break up with your wife and divorce her that is fine but here's the problem if you are going to not even take care of your kids or accept them or talk bad about your kids or even talk bad about your kids is mom on the internet for everybody to see you're not no beta man you honestly not no beta he, he legit called his mom um called their mom like uh leftovers like you have problems talk to your friends about it talk to your uh family about it but don't don't be bringing your kids mom in the line like that's just very disrespectful mad disrespectful and also shows your kids that you're not a good father so that's just my personal message to it do not just just leave it alone I don't know why you feel you gotta dog out your kid's mama. Like you could do it with your homies, bro. You could do it um, with your family, but just just not out in public, man. That's just not alpha at all. It's completely being a beta, to be honest to me. Let's take a look at this video here. Ray has a new stepmother that hates her guys. guts and has tried to steal her boyfriends in the past. The next family gathering Addison attends is going to be the the Christmas from hell. So where has this scandal come from? Is it even true? Unfortunately so. Addison Ray's dad, Monty Lopez, posted a TikTok video of himself making up with influencer Ava Louise and Addison's fans are sadder than ever for her. Ava Louise has a lot to say about Addison, so keep in tune for that and don't forget to subscribe for more juicy, juicy tea. And the fact that he's gonna let some the woman dog out his dad, daughter, Monty Lopez, I, I just, was caught yeah. cheating on his wife, Sherry Esterling, this summer and it's been a downward spiral ever since. Poor Addison Ray has had to witness her parents fight with each other on social media, which is how she makes her living. It's so humiliating for her. It honestly is starting to look like Addison's mom and dad are clout chasing of her fame and success, and they potentially can't get jobs in real life anymore because of their online behaviour, which is causing them to spiral even more for views so that they can cash in on some of that Addison clout. Addison has decided to distance herself from both her parents since all this drama has gone down, and a lot of people feel bad for her mom through all this because her mom is the one that got cheated on, and now she's getting punished by her own daughter because Addison unfollowed both her mom and her dad. What's that all about? In late June, posts about Addison Ray's father with other women started to spread across TikTok and Instagram. Addison then unfollowed his account and Sherry removed wife from her bio. One particularly viral TikTok appeared to show Lopez chatting to a young woman while at a club. On an Instagram story, Lopez responded by commenting, am I the drama? I don't think I'm the drama. Maybe I am. Am I the villain? On July the 7th, Addison's mom finally broke her silence and exposed what had been going on. Personal matters being brought public are always challenging and overwhelming for anyone involved. I will be okay. My That's biggest concern is, and always will be, my children and their fragile hearts and minds. I will always do my best to try to protect them. My goal is to make sure that they feel secure and safe and know that everything will be okay. Thank you for all the love, support and kind messages. It means the world to me. Word got out since then that Addison's dad attends local LA clubs that influencers hang out at and is creepy towards young influencers, a lot of which who are Tana Mojo's friends. And boy, has Tanner had a lot to say about this and the fact he's literally hit on well, her, makes is her involved in everything. Honestly. I feel kind of strange beefing with this man at his prehistoric age, especially when I've seen him put so many things up his nose at several teenage events and i actually remember having to back you off a couple of my friends inside of houses in bedrooms because they were scared 
But this makes great podcast content for Jeff and I, so I would love to make fun of your ass. It turns out that Edison's parents had split up but not made their divorce public for quite some time in respect for their daughter. But if that's the case, why are they being so messy and public about their hate for each other now? Despite Monty treating his ex-wife Cherie like shit and getting caught allegedly cheating on her while they were still together, he's insanely jealous of rapper Young Gravy hitting on Cherie. They've been flirting online publicly together. Maybe that's why Addison's mom got unfollowed by Addison. Addison was probably humiliated at her mother's behaviour. But yeah, Monty was big time jealous when Young Gravy started hitting on his ex. He recently called out Young Gravy when interviewed by Tupacity and it's crazy, and it was game time. These he women wants is to dark, get in the ring with Young Gravy. Addison's dad had also made heaps of TikToks going off at Young Gravy and it's so embarrassing to watch. What's going this on, is not TikTok family? Now, I want to give a shout out to all my Addison Ray fans, Ray family fans, Sherry Nicole fans, Monty Lopez fans, and if you hate me, you really love me, you just can really not. Fans. I really it's appreciate really, all I'm the comments, appreciate here, all like, the likes, and maybe give a shout out to Young Gravy's fans. But Young Gravy needs to watch running his mouth talking about all those MILFs out there, because all those MILFs got some daddies. And some baby daddies and those baby daddies some of them are equally as bad as me some of them are badder some of them can't come close so watch him out when you're slapping your gums bro what i'm really worried about is my two boys going to school and getting picked on because young gravy wants to hook up with their mama what i want them to do is go to school and get praised because young gravy's about to get knocked down in the boxing ring by the daddy so be watching yourself man watch what you say bro you ain't no rapper man clean that up man you a singer go clean your bio up bro you ain't no rapper you a fake rapper peace Young Gravy has actually responded to Monty numerous times. So how many siblings does Edison have? Man, man I've, I've seen at least 40 people with my signature tattooed on them. I see people in Mean Greek that have driven 12 hours to get there, but... I just watched this video today while I'm trying to research this drama. It's legit head. crazy, everything going on. attention and show love. And Mr. Lopez, I'd love to get you some tickets to a show. Get you a great seat, you know, maybe put you in VIP so, so everyone in the crowd can be comfortable. Um, just let me know, baby. We... We love you. We love the fans. He'd even gone on a podcast and boasted about how he wanted to take Edison Ray's mom on a date. What's up with you and, and I'm an Addison Ray guy. Like, what's up with you and her mom? Oh, man, it's on site. Uh, <laughs> Addison Ray's mom, Sherry <laughs> Nicole. I don't know. I tried. I tried at one point. Not, not that there was any sort of preference, but at one point I was kind of trying to fuck with uh, Heidi D'Amelio and then her, her husband hit me up and was not really vibing with it. But he, you know, he, he kind of, in, in a whole, in like a friendly way, he was like, nah, man, like, chill out. Well, yeah, I mean, I can see That's that. my wife. Yeah, yeah, I can yeah. see that. I'm I, married. I, yeah, I didn't know that there was any of that. I, I, see, I don't go on the internet a lot. I post on the internet, but I don't, like, go look at it. So, like, a lot of things end up, like, I learn them in, like, that type of way. I, I don't like that, that flirting with, like, a married woman. Like, you, you didn't know that's frowned upon sometimes? Well, I didn't know she was married, so I, I'm, I'm aware that that'd be frowned upon. I'd probably be pretty mad if I was a, a husband, but I, uh, you know, I... I okay, I, he, I, sounds I general, he sounds general. He sounds legit general. So Edison's mom publicly responds to Young Gravy hitting on her, Edison's dad is out here getting with Edison Ray's number one hater, Ava Louise. So, who remembers that clout-chasing TikToker who licked a toilet seat back in March 2020 at the beginning of the pandemic? She'd also Why hit on you? Bryce Hall, who Edison Ray publicly reminded her was her boyfriend at the time. Well, that's Edison Ray's new stepmom, Ava Louise. Ava Louise has been a multiple scandals throughout her TikTok career. She's been sued by Kris Jenner apparently for making up rumours that Kanye West had cheated on Kim Kardashian with Jeffree Star. And people still don't know if that's a rumour by the way. She'd also claim that she spent the night with Antonio Brown the night before he ran off the field and had a huge meltdown. Her public beef with Addison Rae has been quite blatant and yet her father still chose to hook up with Ava Louise and make it public on TikTok. Oh yeah, Ava Louise is stepdaughter's owned Addison Rae. Apparently they were at a charity basketball game together in LA last night, made out and then went home together. This is all Ava going down here and it's be bad. Because she couldn't get Addison boyfriend she went for her dad people are calling her addison ray's new stepmom and oh this is wild man this is legit wild how this whole thing comment below what you're feeling right now it is absolutely crazy this entire thing and she indeed has responded to these claims this screw your dad and she is now addison ray's new stepmom this is going to be the most awkward family thanksgiving of my life does Monty really hate his daughter that much that he would date her worst enemy? What are your thoughts on Addison Ray's new stepmom? He's not what a beta. He's not an alpha at all. He's a legit beta. That's what I keep saying. Like, what a piece of trash he is. Whoa.